Hey there, Scouts. Me once again, Brian the Chinchilla. Hey there, Gouts. <laughs> hey there, Scouts. It's me once again, Brian the Chinchilla. I had to re-record the intro for this video, um, but it's probably a good thing. So, big piece of information. I was one. I was known in the. I am re. I'm. I have to pee. I have to pee. I have to make this intro quick. You might know me as Tiny Tree for my music channel. I am renaming and rebranding myself as Code Cobalt with this artwork. Why am I shouting this way when my microphone is on my collar? I'm an idiot. I'm rebranding myself as Code Cobalt with this new art, which I did, yes, in MS Paint. But I like the way that it looks. It kind of gives a good vibe, at least to me. This is why I'm changing my name. Tiny Tree was already taken by a band who does like alternative rock and other stuff like that. If you want to go take a listen to their music, such as this, this, and this, go check them out because they make some really good music. This video is going to be the first of two parts. This video is going to be looking back at old projects that I have, old music projects that I've had from this year all the way back to about 2018. The next video will be from 2017 to about 2015, 2016. So there's going to be a lot of music that we're looking at. I'm hoping to cut it down into about 10 to 15 minute long videos. I'm hoping that you guys enjoy looking at my old projects and enjoy my reactions to my old projects as I find some of the ones that I know a lot about, some of the ones that I know pretty much nothing about. And I hope you enjoy it as much as I did making it. So anyway. Without further ado, see you in the see you in the upcoming video. Oh my god, I almost said my outro. Hey guys, guess who forgot to charge their camera batteries? Me, so you're gonna have to deal with the uh, worst quality webcam. Now I did actually open up one old project. Let me show you which one I opened up. I opened up a test project that I did when I first got this computer, this new laptop. So you can see that there's a ton of different things going on, and I wanted to make sure that my computer could actually handle it. When you hear it, it'll just sound really ugly as soon as it gets to the drop, so... There's this whole section where it's like, you know, kind of nice, it's like, oh, this is, this is pretty kind and everything. And then it gets to this part... And then there's like a very, very basic riser that happens here. And then it just descends into... gross. You can see that these are just absolutely clipping the ever-loving crap out of the audio. Which is not what you want in music. So it's gross and it's ugly, but that's why it was a test. I was literally like, let's just make something real quick. I'm gonna get Carl Jr. and right now, okay? Ooh, alright. I'm gonna get Carl's Jr., guys. Drop! That is... Weird. That is very weird. This is just after um, I made the test um, project. This is very weird. What happened? What the fuck happened there? What is going on here? Whoa, was that Citrus that's doing that? Oh, Citrus is killing me with theirs. Wow, Citrus, you just absolutely slaughtered me there. Okay, Doot Doot. <laughs> Doot Doot is a, a recent one, but not like super recent. It's It was like a couple months ago. Ah, that looks kind of, that, that actually looks kind of pleasant. This is a project that I want to work further on because I do kind of like the way that it goes, but of course it's going to take more time and I'm glad that I have time. I can actually open up the project file. Ah, that's what I'm so happy about. What is I don't know? Let's open it and find out. I colored the notes? Okay, this looks like it was something that was layered together. Let's take a listen to see what it, what it is. Oh, I know what this is already. <laughs> Let's 
So this is interesting that I actually colored them, but I didn't name any of the patterns and I didn't really Let me actually open up the one that I really really want to see Spooktober. I did something in there that wasn't that I think I saved it like there, but I didn't save it to the mp4 or no mp3 file that I had saved that I exported with pretty much every one of my other songs. So this one might have stuff in it that I haven't heard in years. Oh my god, I think it is there. Oh my god, it is there. Oh my god, this is so cool. <laughs> oh, this is so cool. The drop happens, and then right here, I actually, halfway through right here, I shifted something to, and I wanted to make a synth that sounded like the electricity, like, um, arc sound. But I, I wanted to make it through a synth instead of, like, downloading a sample. Oh my god, I want to listen to this and see what it sounds like, because I haven't heard this in years. My God, I didn't even realize. <laughs> and then this is where I was working on things. Holy crap, I didn't realize I had that much of the song. I literally only saved it halfway. Holy shit. Oh my god, okay, I need to look through this. I need to, this is crazy. I didn't realize I had that whole, that much saved. This is crazy, this is really cool to me. I hope you guys realize that this is something that's like really making me happy. Oh my god. This is so cool. This is so, so cool. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, this is so cool. This is so cool. What does this sound like? Oh, that is a weird patch. I love that though. Oh my god. I'm sorry if I'm freaking out so much. This is just so cool to me. Dream. Oh, shoot. I think I remember what this one is. This one was a song that I remember hearing, or at least a melody that I remember hearing in a dream of mine. I put a lot more work into actually organizing it to make it look right. Jeez, I did a lot more work than I thought on this one. This one looks interesting. Yes, I love this lead. It's exactly how I remember it to be, too. Oh! Yes, this is one that I definitely want to look at. It's weird how I actually organized this one, because I do not remember organizing any of my songs ever. <laughs> Grime. I think this one's not gonna work. But I could be wrong. I love that part. Well, like, I'm gonna go back to that part. I don't know why that part sounds so good. Um, it, it's actually really funny. This little thing here. <laughs> if I remember right, this one was made from a video from uh, King Boo. Uh, Mario screaming. But I, I made a sample, and I was like, I'm gonna make this into a thing that I can play. And thus was born... That! Oh hey, a song. What is this one? Oh, this looks weird. This looks funky. What is this? It 
What's this one? Oh my god, I love this one. remember the beginning like the very first bit I don't remember adding that this part and it's such a simple project I remember this being such a simple project that I was like man like I don't have to put there's there's like a few different tracks that I'm putting this stuff on because I didn't need that much but it's I really love where was it this this part over here where like you have the mix between like Like the upbeat, and then like it gets a little bit slower there, in the middle, and then it gets back to like that. I don't know. I love that part too. Ah, oh. but I think we're gonna move on from that to the stream thing. Oh, I don't remember this one very well. Wii music sounding. Honestly sounds like Wii music. <laughs> it's got like those happy tones and then like the drums in the background for whatever reason just make it conjures up images of just like Wii music. And I don't know why. I, I think it's just got like similar qualities. I don't remember this one. <laughs> I'll be honest. Oh wait, was it Pattern 11? Yep. Very odd to me. That's just a very odd note progression there. I just made this in a stupor one day. Okay, so the next one is Strem, which I think I have a good idea of what this one is. Yeah, this is it. Mm -hmm. I've used this plenty of times in other videos. I started this on a stream and then I ended it um, off camera, which is typically how a lot of projects go. William Osmond, I'm gonna go ahead and open up William Osmond because I'm fairly certain that one's gonna be pretty empty of what gave that song character, which was the samples. And there's actually still quite a bit of song here that we can listen to because I did use a lot of synths. It's so, it's so empty without all of the samples. Doesn't feel right. Riser. A lot of what gave a character is gone, but the main song is still there. So interesting, and it's on insert five. Did I put like a distortion on here? Yep, fast distort. Uh, metric EQ. Oh, look at that weird EQ. That is a weird looking EQ. Man, what was I doing there? I mean, it works. Let's open this one up. I'm hoping this is the Gremlins at Work. Okay, this looks like it's the... This is Gremlins at Work. Okay. It's Pattern 11. Pattern 11 has some really nice... There it is. I love this bass. Just that right there. Ow. Oh. Mixed in with the kicks. Oh, that is good. So much fun to make, though. Let's open up vocal cuts. Oh, no. All of, all of them? Wow. Here's, here's the thing that I'm talking about. That right there. What did I do? Okay, so I had the tenor sax and trombone, and then I had a mini synth, and then the three times oscillator, which is... Just a bass. But this one... Okay, let's solo it and just see what I did here. Okay. 
And when we plug that in with... That's so good to me. I really like what, I, what, what that sounds like. Unus Honest, which we have three different versions saved. I'm gonna try to open up version three. So a lot of the important stuff's still here. Okay, so a lot of these samples. This is the final project that I have saved on this computer. I might shift some more over from my old computer to here, um, which is gonna include some really interesting projects as well. Unless I already have them. Do I already have them? Oh... We do have more.